Every year, the American Bell Association holds a convention, and this year we're in Dubuque, Iowa for our 74th convention. And right now we're going to look at a display of teething rings and baby rattles. Just a few moments ago, there were some visitors that came in and were looking at the different displays, some young folks, and they didn't know what a teething ring or baby rattle was. Look at these old things. They go back a long way. But today's children are raised with different things. But look at these, aren't they fun? Some of us remember these and the little sounds that they made for our children <laughs> or for us. We probably don't remember that, but we may still have them. Now we get into the fancier ones. Look at these. With the face, almost looks like Shakespeare. I wonder if it is. All different types. And of course the ring was the teething ring. And the ones made out of ivory were so durable that they lasted all through our days of crying and having those teeth come in. Look at the duckies. Little bear. Some of these like this one right here would have been engraved with somebody's name and the date of birth. And these would have been gifts to the happy parents, or perhaps at this stage, the not so happy parents. Wow. Can't you just hear the sound? Yes, of the baby crying, but also of the bell, the rattle. The American Bell Association has collectors of all different kinds of bells. You can visit us at AmericanBell.org and get an idea of the variety of collections some of our members have. Thank you for spending time with us.